Hi guys, Brent here and welcome to another commentary video. Today we're going to be talking about was anonymous mode a mistake? Because anonymous mode uh, was added all in DVD all the way back in the Wesker update, which is kind of wild to think about that it's been in the game for over two years at this point. It still feels like it was just added yesterday, but it's actually been a pretty long time since it's been added. Um, it was a very, very controversial measure because initially behavior added this measure as a way to protect players in Dead by Daylight, but it kind of didn't pan out that way. And I'm going to go on a limb here and say that it actually has done more harm than it actually has done good. So yeah, go ahead and talk about it. If you initially rolled out the anonymous mode with all the current privacy options simply labeled as streamer options, <laughs> so it's very clear what it was meant for right away. This was meant for streamers to be able to not have players see them in their games, and for whatever reason, the DVD community is very anti-streamer and anti-content creator. Like, if you spend any amount of time on, like, DVD Reddit, DVD Twitter, uh, it's not hard to find somebody complaining about a Twitchy or somebody being cringy or just kind of, like, going on, like, you know, old man shouts at Sky about people playing the video game online and streaming it to other people. Um, for whatever reason, uh, the community is just kind of weird about that. And it's something that I've never been able to figure out besides people just being weird about streaming in general. Maybe that's a whole other video we can make as why is the DVD community like that. But to circle it back around to the topic, um, so in your games, uh, ever since this has been a thing, you could turn on anonymous mode because TTVs before this existed would often get targeted. Even if they don't have the actual TTV in their name, people would actively go searching through their profile and, you know, Try to skim through their social medias by you know copy pasting the name and even if you didn't have your twitch advertised in your steam it was probably very easily uh to find it um so they would find the streamer and harass them so behavior implemented this to protect them however i feel like this like very thoroughly backfired um between 2022 and 2024 which is you know the the time frame we're looking at i believe it was august it was wesker yeah it was august maybe it was the end of august but yeah it was august and we are currently as of recording in september 2024 um i've received more harassment than I ever did before anonymous mode was introduced to the game. Why? Well, it's pretty simple. Now everyone can be as mean and as nasty as they want, as long as it's within the confines of DBD's report system rules. There's not even like a name behind the person doing it. So nine times out of 10, when I'm being made fun of, harassed, whatever you want to call it, nine times out of 10 when this is happening, it's an anonymous mode player. It, 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 in a sense, it like opened up the floodgates for people to be nasty, rude, awful, whatever you want to call it. Like there's just not as much repercussions because there's not a name tied to the person doing it. At least before this was implemented, I could see a name in my lobbies and go, oh, I don't want to play with that guy. That guy was an asshole to me before, so I'm going to go next. I'm, I would rather shop lobbies and have longer queue times than play with somebody who's nasty and awful. <laughs> um, however, now I run into this person again and again, and because they're always playing in the non mode, I don't see them coming, and I'm just constantly subjected to them being nasty and awful because there's quite literally no way to know it's the same person over and over. Dead by Daylight does actually have the option to block people, but much like the kudos option, this is probably one of the most useless functions that they've ever put in the game, which is saying something considering it's the game of Dead by Daylight, where a lot of things break, don't work, etc. Um, now, do I see the merits in an anonymous mode? Yeah, especially for content creators. I use anonymous mode. I use anonymous mode when I play Survivor off stream because like, I just want to vibe like everybody else, you know? I'm kind of an introverted heart. Uh, I, when the camera goes off, I'm very quiet and I just kind of want to relax. Um, so anonymous mode lets me do that without having to kind of like bring out like that content creator energy just while I'm playing the game uh, by myself with, with all the lights off, you know? However, what has actually happened in terms of most uses of the anonymous mode is while it's meant initially to protect streamers from harassment, it's instigated it's instigated it more by giving nasty people an extra level of an an anonymity and an anemones an anemones yeah that <laughs> uh, to shield themselves from having consequences to their actions so it, i think it has ultimately failed in its endeavor to try and keep us safe and actually has made things even worse so yeah that kind of sucks but i think it's one of the things that doesn't really get a light shown on it uh, very often because obviously unless you content create yourself it's not something that really affects you right like either you're actively the person using it uh to hurt people <laughs> and you're using anonymous mode uh nefariously in that case uh a heck user uh but other than that if you're not actually a content creator or a streamer like you're just like not using it so it doesn't feel like it's an issue that's like really brought up often or something that people really talk about uh but yeah 
DLDR, if you have not paid attention this far somehow, uh, I do believe that the anonymous mode uh, failed in its endeavor, which behavior clearly defined is trying to help protect streamers from harassment. Because I feel like that extra level, uh, that extra shield that they have uh, of not knowing what their name is, has allowed them to actually divvy out more harassment and more bullying that was not previously there before. So. Yeah, what do you think? Do you think the anonymous mode failed or do you think it's fine? Let me know down in the comments below, friends. But other than that, that is it for today's video. But I do upload daily, so I will see you tomorrow. But if I do not, I will see you when I see you. Goodbye.